Hello all, we're just making our way into the small country town of Euroa, which is also uh, very famous for when the old uh, legendary Ned Kelly, uh, back in uh, 10th of December 1878, he robbed the bank here at uh, Euroa with his uh, Kelly gang, and that's what virtually uh, bought his uh, down, down coming because from then he was raiding around all these towns like Gerildry, Banala, and then eventually where we're going to go through Glen Rowan, which was where he was finally uh, uh, surrounded and captured. Uh, we'll talk about that later. Euroa, it's only a small town, like I said, about three and a half thousand people. Sleepy little village now when the uh, the highway used to go through here, the Hume Highway. Uh, now it's all bypassed uh, between Melbourne and Sydney now. They've still kept the traffic lights here though. This can get busy during the daytime, this intersection. Uh, this is a very rich wool growing area. Uh, it's also, this is known as the Strathbogie Ranges nearby this region of uh, Euroa. And uh, Ah, uh, speak of the devil, there's Ned. When we get past these traffic lights, James, try and zoom in on this little fellow here. Where? Just on this building up here, you can see the 800, 8,000 pounds reward for the capture of Ned Kelly. You'll just see it up here. Yeah, I see. A lot of old buildings here. That's the uh, Kelly, there, there we are, that's a love. We'll, I'll pull over and get a bit of video on that in a minute, but we'll just keep going through here for the time being make our way over the river. It's called the Seven Creeks area. And um, this is exactly halfway between Melbourne and the, the uh, Victoria New South Wales border. We're just coming up to, uh, so there's a lovely river here, the uh, part of one of the Seven, seven Creeks. shut the survey down here. I've been through this place in about 10 years and uh, yeah, no, it's sort of almost like a town you blink and you miss it but there's a lot of history around here. Alright, we'll call it, uh, call it a day here for the time being and we'll get back to you soon. Thank you very much.